Hi guys, welcome to Kerry Amber Music Promotions Live. Yeah. So guys, I just um came on here just to touch on some little topics that is breaking news right now. So we're gonna talk about the eclipse for um the, the eclipse that took place yesterday, uh Monday. April 8th. I know a lot of Christians or so-called Christian people are very disappointed because the rapture didn't happen. No rapture. Eh? Everybody's stuck on this earth still, right? Because them say every time something happened, people say, oh, it's the end of the world. They've been saying it's the, that the world is, is going to end since 1999. Yeah. But unfortunately, it didn't end yesterday, so we're all stuck here. That is it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So the eclipse happened yesterday. I did put up a small little clip of it on my um, pages uh, in Dallas, Texas. Um, they saw it there, and it was very beautiful watching it here on social media. So big up to the people in Dallas, Texas. Thank you for sharing the eclipse with us, and it was amazing, guys. Um, it's amazing how God works or the universe, whatever you call him works because no man on this earth has the power to do that. You cannot, how, I mean, come on. The moon was right between the sun and the earth and blotted out the sun for like whatever, a couple minutes, whatever it was. And it's amazing. So it just goes to prove that don't worry about nothing in life, guys. Don't worry about people fighting against you. Don't worry about people turning against you because them not have no power if them can't make the the sun eclipse or the moon eclipse with the earth and the sun them not have no power so don't fear nobody on this earth because them just like us eat and drink and open their mouth and talk nonsense yeah so big up to the universe big up to the eclipse it was beautiful it was wonderful we're still here unfortunately the christian people or whatever people out there that pretend that they love god Y'all stuck here on this earth with all of us, unfortunately. Anyway, moving on, guys. So I stayed up um last night until 6 a.m. this morning, Tuesday morning, because I was watching the live streamers um from Twitch. They are in Jamaica, and I just want to say big up to them in Jamaica. I was in Jamaica last month, guys. Um, you know, after I went to Panama for my birthday and it was awesome. I still have a little tan thing I go on, you know. Yeah, I'm gonna, gonna cancel the tan, right? From Jamaica. Jamaica's a beautiful island. Just be safe, guy. But I wanna say big up to um what a live streamer name again. The Shea Frost. He was live streaming on Twitch last night, Monday night at Uptown Monday, guys. Yeah. I don't know how the foreigners them do it, but they know the hot spots in Jamaica to go to. And I'm very, very impressed and I'm very, very happy for them that they, whoever, whichever local Jamaican they are linking up with is, um, yeah, they are on point with telling them the hot spots in Jamaica. Uptown Mondays is one of them, of course. You have Bossy Tuesday, you have Weddy Weddy Wednesday at Stone Love HQ. Thursday, I'm not sure what they have. It used to be whopping. I'm not sure if whopping is still a one. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday is my rest day. Right? So, yeah. Big up to also the ones who was at Mecca. Who was at Mecca in Marketplace again? Um, I think it was Kai. Oh, uh, yeah. Kai and Kai Senat and Aiden. Ross, they were both at Mecca, yeah. I think that was Sunday night, I believe, or something like that. And, um, yeah, they enjoyed themselves. Kai Sinet, um, was in Jamaica and he went to Jamaica Carnival with his friends with Ray. These are all t um, Twitchers, they're all on Twitch, guys. So you can follow them on, on Twitch because they live stream on Twitch. These are gamers, they play video games and they live stream wherever they are. Yeah, so big up to Kai Senat and his crew, Ray, of course, the Japanese guy. Yo, he's hilarious. I watch him as well on YouTube. So big up to Kai Senat, Aiden Ross, and their teams. They're all in Jamaica. The Frost and um, Power Actor. 
power actor Michael Rainey Jr. They're in Jamaica right now. And um, yeah, they were at Uptown Mondays last night. Mecca all over the place. Big up to the foreigners, them that are flying into Jamaica. Yeah, big them up and they kept themselves safe. You know, so, you know, big up to all who attended Jamaica Carnival over the weekend. Yeah, that was fun to watch as well. Big up to Jamaica Walk By where I watch it on YouTube. I'm not missing anything. Not being in Jamaica because I know say, the YouTubers them. Yeah, they got it on lock. Um, I do, it's just putting the word up on them page and I see what's going on in Jamaica, the island. So big up to them. So big up to all the foreigners, them that are in jamaica last night me say um yeah reggae reggae entertainer kabaka pyramid i tell um the frost and they must not put the camera on him me not understand what's going on with kabaka pyramid from him when grammy the man hype up himself but we know that that this is going to happen so it's okay i was like did does he know who these guys are. These are live streamers. They have more fans than him. Please. So, it's okay. I don't understand. People in Jamaica are running from camera that have businesses and music to promote. It's an opportunity for you to get exposure. But anyway, different mindsets and that is it, guys. But I just want to say big up to them. Big up to all the people all the foreigners them that are flocking to jamaica the youtubers them they're flocking there yeah yeah from africa um, from africa from kenya they are out there you know uplifting the jamaican people and because they have some people in a jamaica where mindset is very very low and they don't think highly of themselves but the africa mama africa is sending the africans them to jamaica to uplift them and tell them, yes, you are important. You are somebody. You understand? You have to be more loving and do away with the hatred and the fight. Please stop. But people, Jamaica is beautiful. I know there was the U.S. put a, um, a, a thing on Jamaica to be safe. It's a level three. I'm not sure the level of it now. But like I said, Jamaica is beautiful. You just have to be safe. As with anywhere you travel or anywhere you live, you have to pray before you go on the road and make sure you are you keep yourself safe guys so big up to all the foreigners them going to jamaica i'm telling you i love it it's awesome and it's amazing thank you guys yeah so oh and before i forget i'm going to put some of the clips them from the you know the live streamers them the youtubers that are in jamaica um i'm gonna put up some little video clips small video clips of what i'm talking about so you could fast forward to the end of this video to if you don't want to hear me talking okay good so again i just want to big up kai Sinat, aiden ross michael rainey jr power actor and also the Shea Frost, yeah, they're in Jamaica and they're hanging out and having fun. Thank you all for coming to Jamaica. Thank you for appreciating my small little island where you can party seven days a week. And Kai Sinet went to KFC. Them tell him about KFC, guys. Yeah, awesome. Thank you. Yes, and the carnival. Yeah, big up to all the live streamers, guys. So you can follow me now on Twitch, guys. I, I am on Twitch and I'm going to be live streaming on Twitch. So follow me on Twitch. Yeah. And also, don't forget, before I forget, Sunday, July 7th, guys, is going to be KBMP Sip and Paint event. So look out for that. Sunday, July 7th, Queens, New York from 10 a.m. until 12 noon. I'm going to have a live painter, guys, for the two hours. So come on out. Everything is included. You're going to have the free art supply, free drinks, free parking is available. And it's going to be at Baisley Pond Park, Yellow Picnic area in Queens, New York. So come on out for that. Thank you guys for the support. Um, make sure you guys follow me on YouTube at Carrie Ambrose Music Promotions. Um, road to 5k 
yeah big up to all those who are subscribing to my youtube channel i just want to say big up to all the positive people that are following my pages them and supporting me genuinely it doesn't is it doesn't hurt and it it won't cost nothing to to press like or to even comment something positive on somebody's post if you like it but as i said thank you to all my followers and subscribers the positive ones thank you for the support um big up to all the people out there the few people that do believe in me and my work and support it with a clean open heart thank you very very much i appreciate it very very much guys yeah so that is the news so far um uh, um yeah july 7th don't forget my uh kbmp sip and paint big up to kbmp clothing big big up also to kbmp edibles check out also guys my um uploads of my recent trip to panama um i know i have been telling you guys to take a trip to panama take a trip anywhere the caribbean you do not need any visa to travel to panama nor the caribbean trinidad costa rica dominica Dom, um, dominican republic you do not need any visa to go there you just need your passport your jamaican passport or american passport whatever it is save up your money if you work every day save your money up for a trip or a little birthday trip or a little summer trip whatever it, it is save your money up guys and live some life don't be like some people are miserable and throwing hate every day right so check out my panama vlogs on my youtube channel um if you're going to panama link up with my tour guide his name is tommy cisneros of best panama tours on instagram link up with him he's bilingual he speaks both english and spanish and will coordinate any place you want to go any tour you want to go in panama he will coordinate with you and if he cannot take you there um he will set up uh like a drive or i know for some excursion he he will drop you off at the pickup point and you will go on the excursion for the day yeah but he does do pickups and drop offs to the airport and also he picks you up for the tours his tours last about four or five hours check out my videos on my youtube channel of panama and you will see yeah panama is boom is booming over there big up to the the people of panama especially panama city um the language barrier is not a problem as long as you download um google translate on your phone they have it too down there the local people and that's how i was able to talk to them you know i know one or two little spanish words so I communicate but i had my phone with me so guys come on take some travel it's a new year don't do the same thing every year don't be a yamed please five year plan if it's your if it's to travel if it's to open a business work on it right now work on it today work on your dreams and your goals today and don't and just live and be happy and be grateful and thankful also check out my um airbnb yeah my airbnb vlog also of from jamaica of jamaica as well i stayed at a beautiful airbnb airbnb here bnb in kingston and it's on my youtube channel so guys just head over to my youtube channel subscribe watch the videos comment positively and press like and tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend and i thank you guys very very much yes now, in the other news now, so you guys, you remember the Baltimore Key Bridge collapse, which was, which happened March 26, 2024? Yeah, it's on my page. It's on my Blogspot page. Anyway, so over the weekend on Sunday, Channel 7 News here in New York City reported that an, a ship lost power near the Verrazano Bridge. And a tugboat helped it to the shore where it was, you know, restored back. Its power came on. 
and the boat you know the ship went along its merry merry ways so guys some people are saying that this okay this second incident with a ship near a bridge is reminding us of the baltimore key bridge collapse right so you know the people then who have um what do you call it? The conspiracy theories, right? They believe, oh my God, now they're trying to blow up the world. Now they're trying to come to New York with the same bridge thing. But it didn't happen, guys. It didn't happen. Okay? So according to ABC News, they said Friday, April 5th, um, a ship lost power near the Verrazano Bridge and a tugboat helped it to shore and it got powered back and it went back on its way. So thank God for that. We were saved because people was like, oh my God, what is this? The same thing I said with the eclipse. Oh my God, the world is going to end. Anyway, but, um, it's okay. They don't just uh, cause chaos and all type of nonsense over here. So it's okay. Okay, guys. So as I said to you, you know, upcoming events. Was, is my event, July 7, 2024, KBMP Sip and Paint in the Park. General tickets and VIP tickets now available. VIP gets food. Everybody gets free parking, free paint supplies, free drinks, okay? That's July 7, 2024, Queens, New York, right here. Yeah. May 18th, Fest of Spring in Baltimore, Maryland. May 18th, again, Bounce Music Festival in Orlando. And this is May 18th. Um, also... April 20th, which is next, not this week, I'm on the following week, next weekend, is Record Store Day at VP Records. I will be there. So look out for my live stream on Twitch. Follow me on Twitch, guys, if you're on Twitch. Follow me over there. That is my new site where I'm going to be live streaming from. So that is it, guys. Um, big up to everybody. Thank you to everybody. You know, um, thank you for the support over the years and um yeah follow like share subscribe yeah to carry and brown music promotions that is it and um yeah subscribe to my youtube channel if you like positive content thank you so much remember to pray guys and keep your mindset and your actions uh positive okay yeah, and that is it, guys. See you guys later. It's really dark out. There's three more books. That's spicy or no? No, barbecue. I want some spicy barbecue. This is spicy. Yeah, that's spicy. Nah. This spicy? Mm. Hey, it's spicy. I'm gonna go sorry, but. Go up. Nah, we're in my mind. thing. Nah. There's three of them. Look, 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 look at this. This is a, this is good chicken, chat. Nah, no funny shit. I can't see pen. I can't see the pen. That's tough. Toronto. That's tough. That's tough. What? What do you want? Why you wear something? Man, come on. What? it up. Hey, Chad.
Come on. 